We are going straight to the trenches for this battle. Which is the better choice? A slap to the face or trying to learn assembly language? A tough decision must be made. Let's try and figure this one out. So what is the purpose of each one? Well, the purpose of a slap would be to cause pain by physically demonstrating disapproval of someone or disapproval of their actions. On the other hand, assembly is a low-level programming language that is designed to be readable by humans and able to directly communicate with computer hardware. The effects a slap to the face can be painful. However, learning assembly language can hurt just as much but for a longer period of time. Let's talk about the positives now. Being slapped in the face can wake you up after you stayed up all night arguing with 12 year olds on Fortnite. A positive for assembly, it will give you a much higher level of understanding of the computer abstraction process and appreciation for how easy we have it now with modern programming languages. Not to mention if you manage to get a grip on assembly then you'll feel that power, you will enter god mode, you will feel like you can type in passwords the first time correctly and you might even be able to beat those 12 year old kids at Fortnite. So which one should you choose? Does it depend on who's doing the slapping? In reality, I am giving assembly language a hard time because it didn't hold my hand in college. The truth is assembly language is super uber powerful and is still being used today for the toughest challenges. It's like a superhero. When you need something done at the highest level of efficiency, when you want to mess with hardware directly, when you need to handle critical performance issues, when all is lost unless you can give the processor direct special instructions, we use, we use assembly, assembly language. language.